Hey, I'm playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, I love this game. It has really great graphics. I was just waiting more for more of an update. But um, today I'm just going to do random things that could get you money in the game. Gonna do a little bit of fishing, a little bit of blackjack. Scar, hello, hello, Snipes, hello. How you doing, guys? Welcome to the stream. I'm good, bro. Just trying out this uh, Red Dead here. Did you guys ever play this game? <laughs> That's good, man. Oh, really? That's great. Thank you, Medium. Appreciate it for dropping that like. Thank you, bro. Love those battlefield streams, man. Thank you. Oh, are you? I'll stop on by uh, when I'm done, if you're still on. All right, bro. You have a good one, man. That's good. Um, so pretty much um, I'm in the area that is like the foggiest area in the world right now. <laughs> but as you can see, yeah, it's really dark. Let's try to go to a different lobby so it won't be so dark. I'm trying to get to a different lobby, but to be honest, I kind of don't remember how to do it. Um, is it? No, it's not here. All right, Scar, you got a good day, man. Thank you for stopping by. Drop me that like, bro. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Aaron, what's up, bro? Welcome, man. Thanks for dropping that like, man. Appreciate it, bro. I wonder if I could catch any fish in this swamp. Nah, uh, probably not. TC Gamer, hello, welcome, man. I haven't seen you in a while. Welcome to the stream, bro. <laughs> so good snipes this game um i love this game I haven't, I haven't played it in a while because i was waiting for more um updates because i felt like this game really needed like a really big update but um in terms of graphics and detail of the surrounding area like it's amazing like if you could just see here like just look at this detail right here Yeah, man, there's those different, those different time zones, man. TC, you happy today? I'm happy too. Why are you happy though? Let me, tell, let me know why you're happy. And then I'll tell you why I'm happy. Cookie, thank you for dropping that like and thank you for dropping that cookie on my stream. Appreciate it. <laughs> I 
How you doing, Cookie? Oh, that's cool, man. That's really cool. Man, that's awesome. Mantis, hello, my friend. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Oh, okay. That's okay, Cookie. What you shopping for? What you getting today? Why am I happy? I'm happy because everybody's here today with me during during my stream right now. So I'm real happy. <laughs> I'm happy that God woke me up this morning to have a another day. I'm happy that um, I get to stream with you fine people. I'm happy that I got a crazy vertical leap. I'm just happy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Curtis, hello. Mantis, yeah bro, it's online. How's the signature emoji? It's amazing, dude. Some nice signature uh, emoji there. Nice. Get that, get that Walmart shopping going. To get him like a couch. I mean, not a couch. <laughs> like furniture and stuff, like tables. Doing some Christmas shopping. What we thinking here? What we doing? Thank you, TC Gaming, for dropping that like. Curtis, what's up, bro? What is up? How do I jump my horse? Oh, okay. We just break it and just keep on moving. That's great. What's this here? Seems like uh, there's something here. Something in the spot, maybe. I thought you said they'd be here. That's what I thought. Is this? Oh, them? I did it already, Mantis. Nope. I worked already. There they are in the wagon. <laughs> This came back. That's her. This came back from work. Oh, kind of nice. For the Twin Rocks gang? Isn't everybody? I got them for you. In the back. Go ahead. Count them up. They're all there. What's this? A bounty hunter mission? God damn. A one, two. Yeah, man. Two and a half. Let me get you your money. That's something. Bringing all them boys in, you know. Bounty hunting ain't so hard. Any By the way, I enjoyed playing, um... I so sure. I enjoyed playing, uh... Fool enough to try? Apex if you are on hunter? PC, bro. It was cool. There's a board up in most every jailhouse and post office. The sheet's going up regular. All you need is a license, which the sheriff will sell you. You can take down a poster and go. Alive, get your full price. <laughs> dead a little less. I'm giving my fixing. You go after one of the big ones, I'll tell you what I know about them, as a favor. The worst that can happen is they kill you. Hey, Cookie, take There's care. There's only nine. I counted them twice. There was ten when I pulled up. I know you're hiding out there. You got ten seconds to turn yourself in. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. <laughs> five. Four. Three. No. Two. No, please. One. Please, no. Oh, damn. There's your tent. Clean it up, Archibald. If it ain't all here, I will be back. I'm sure you will. That one there might want a bounty hunting license. Help him out, won't you? That true? You want a license? Okay. Give me a license. Out of money, huh? 
Well, if you don't have it now, you can come and get a license when you do. They sell them wherever they hang them posters. Good luck now. Oh, they give me, did they give me a license? Oh, approach the board. Okay. Let's approach the board. Bounty hunter board. Um, dead or alive. Fifteen gold. Who has fifteen gold? I know I don't got no fifteen gold. Oh, that sucks. I only got three gold. <laughs> right, Mathis? Like, what's going on? Felix, hello. Welcome to the stream, man. Alright, Snipe. See you later, bro. Thanks for joining me, man. That's a lot of gold for a license. Like, I don't got that kind of money laying around. You got that kind of money? I don't got no 15 gold. The graphics here are just amazing though. Like I don't think any game right now is beating these graphics. I don't know. I don't know why you need a, a horse license. <laughs> I don't know. It's weird. Welcome, sir. Hope we make a good impression. Where's the poker table? Now, how can I ease your troubles? Uh, you could give me a whiskey. That's That'd be great. Thank you. <laughs> I don't get it either. That's weird. Felix, for sure, bro. Of course I can, man. For sure, I got you, Felix. I will shoot you dead. You better not say that. Excuse me. I will definitely play Jump Force, though, tomorrow. For sure, I got you, man. Yeah, let's go to the waypoint. I think we need to go to a more uh, popular town. So let's, let's spend a little money to do that fast travel. Travel. Um, let's go to Valentine's. It's only two bucks. Curtis, I'm good, bro. I'm good. Feeling good, man. So playing some uh, Red Dead here. Trying out some new updates. So good, Felix. Hopefully, we stream around the time you could, you could watch, and uh, then you'll be good, man. It's okay, Felix. It's all good, bro. Yeah, the, I mean, for me, the bounty hunter thing, that's new to me. It may not be new to, to some of you guys, as uh, you probably play Red Dead a lot. But to me, like, the, the bounty hunter thing, Hello that's there. new. To see you. I got deliveries? What do I have? Uh, business opportunity? Let's collect all. Thank you, Felix. Thank you for for dropping that like, man. Matter of fact, everybody, make sure you drop that like. And uh, those of you new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. Really appreciate that, guys. I really, really do. Just appreciate all the support I've been getting lately. Thank you guys so much. Yeah, these mustaches are real, bro. <laughs> Oh, get out of my way! Get out of my way! What are you waiting for? Here we go. Let me let me park my horse. I don't want to walk in there with a rifle, 
So I'm just gonna put my I'm gonna I'm keep my two guns out though. I'm gonna keep my guns out Here we go make sure we put our guns away now Here we go Why is my horse red? I think that's like a a race horse or something that I got. So I think I think it's like a special breed that horse. All right, man. I'm about to get some Chinese food myself, Kurt. You have a good one, bro. Thank you for stopping by, dropping that like, man. Appreciate it, Felix, bro. I cannot wait. For the new games coming out on 2020, man, I can't wait. Mainly, I can't wait for um, Last of Us 2. I really can't wait for that game. <laughs> I'm not young. <coughs> I ain't too young for that. <laughs> <coughs> But Felix, my Thanksgiving was amazing, bro. How about you? I cannot afford to buy him a $5 game. I got $173, and I can't afford the minimum. What is going on with the game right now? Your brother plays Red Dead? Um, I'm pretty sure on uh, Last of Us 2, Dying Light 2, I think the other new Dead Island is coming out as well. There's a lot of games coming out, honestly. <laughs> yeah, I was like, how can I not buy in, like, the game? Like, I didn't get that. Hold on guys, let me fix something real quick. That way I could just talk to you guys straight. Hold on. Alright, and we're back. Yeah, we can't forget those new um that new Ninja Turtles, you know. It's gonna be it's gonna be a great year. Alright, Mantis. Oh, what? what is going on? I cannot buy in a $25 game? How? Maybe they want me to do like actual missions before I, I like mingle in town. Alright, you know, let's do an actual mission. Yeah, bro, it's gonna be a, a, a great year, um, 2020, man. Oh, there's somebody over there that wants you to talk to him. So we're just gonna ride through the mountainside. Of course, Felix, go ahead, bro. Mr. Goat, man, thank you for joining me. Man, I saw your name and I said, man, I love the name. I love the name, bro. Just welcome to the Goat family, man. I love the name. I love you guys. Thank you so much for supporting me, guys. Really appreciate it. Right? Goat fam. Gotta support all, all our goats out there, man. Gotta support everybody. Oh, what just happened? Oh, look, this guy's gonna try and kill me. That's great. Look at this guy. Look, I don't want your pelt. You can keep on. I'm just rolling by. Oh, I didn't mean to run you over. I really didn't mean it. 
Oh, this guy's gonna kill me for running him over. Oh man. He's trying to roll out. Yeah, I ran him over. I didn't mean to run him over. Oh boy. Oh. Oh no, he lassoed me. Get out of here, dude. Try to lasso me? Get out of here. How dare you kill my horse gamer girl hello there welcome 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 you see these guys are uh, they kept coming after me I was like why do they keep coming after me oh man <clears throat> welcome to the stream guys welcome 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 Man, make sure you guys drop that like button if you're new to the channel. Make sure you subscribe. Really appreciate that, guys. Really do. And I appreciate that love and support. These guys keep coming after me. Oh, wow. <clears throat> this is what this game right now is about. Right now, you're trying to get to one place, and then somebody just comes through and just pops you real quick. Get out of here. Oh, my. What? Yeah, for sure, bro. Of course, man, since we could play more. Gamer Girl, what's up? Hello, hello. What you doing? What you doing, Gamer Girl? Welcome. I know it's, ga it's Girl Gamer, but, you know. Oh, we gotta kill this thing. We gotta kill it. We, we're gonna need that for later. I really hope somebody doesn't come up on me though while I'm trying to skin this goat. I'm gonna try to take my um... I'm gonna try to take my, my hide right now. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh man. That's dirty. This is dirty. Oh man. I can't catch him. Oh, I can't catch him hide for nothing. Emily, hello. Welcome to the stream. I know, right? Can't We can't just chill and cut some hide. Welcome everybody new to the channel. Appreciate you guys stopping by. Make sure you guys smash that like button. And if you're new, subscribe. Really appreciate that, guys. Maybe. Maybe, Mantis. We, we don't know. It could be. It's okay, though. It's fun, though. I'm not going to lie. I, I don't mind it. Damn, I need some more ammo. What other games I play? Um, I play everything, bro. <laughs> I play it all, man. If there's a game that you want to see, or you or um, you want to request a game for me to play, I'll I'll get on it, man. I'll play it. Look at they're just hunting me down now. 
First of all, how is he moving faster than my horse right now? Did you see that? He he wasn't riding any horse. He was riding faster than me. Nah, it's all good. I love these questions, Felix. I love them. Play everything, man. Oh, look at this guy. Look at him. Look at him. Oh, get out of here. Where's the sister? Oh, come here. Oh, come here. Get out of here. Both of you. Oh man, I love Fortnite and Call of Duty, man. I love playing those two games. Oh, my other horse came out. All right, we're, we're riding Sugar. This is my this is my horse Sugar right here. Oh, get out of here! Try to kill me again. I'm tired of you guys. Get out of here. Hopefully we could play a game of Fortnite one of these days, Mr. Go. I, I play I play as a hot dog man. Uh yeah, I feel like like I was saying before, I love the game's graphics. I love the game's detail. However, I feel like this game should have had a lot more like don't you guys think The game would have been much better if you could buy your own house like in GTA Not only buy your own house, but like have your own land I thought that would have been really dope because this it's a big it's a big map, you know They should have made it like GTA we could um have your own land in your own house oh yeah PC I'm, I'm sure it does PC is like it's completely optimized on PC completely because you know the better graphics cards you can keep adding to it you know Is that for PS4, Mr. Go? Or can I play with you um cross play? Does it matter? I don't I don't know. Yeah, but I think it just would have made it a little bit interesting if they would have had at least you could buy your house. That would have been enough for me. Hello, stranger. Oh, is it? Oh, okay. I, to be honest, I never really noticed when I played Fortnite. I was just killing people. Go away, or I see much pain and suffering in your future. I got you, Mr. Goat. I'll send you a friend request um, after my stream. I got you. Make sure you know what you're getting into with this one. Hey, please don't listen to him. I am Madame Massard, channeler of spirits. Oh, what's she talking about? Since everyone seems to be a fortune teller for now, seller of the strange and exotic. Which one of these can I help you with today? Wait, don't speak. Let me see. Yes, yes. You Fortnite. I was knocking people out in Fortnite. I was throwing people off the roof. I was throwing people in the water. I had a great time in Fortnite. I just hate. Hate the building. It, it's not that. It's not something lost. It's something you're missing. Yeah. Yeah. What's in there? Some meaning in the chaos of this life. Well, you see, that is something I can help you with. Come to work for me. I say I find things, but really, it is others who do the finding. I tell them what I'm looking for, and they collect it for me from far and wide. She's swindling some people. And sometimes through great hardship, it is work that can be as honest or really dishonest as you want it to be. Hmm. Oh, Bobby, 
Do you want to be one of my <laughs> Okay, we <laughs> be. They are rewarded for a small fee is really the least I should ask for giving you what you're Do I um Do you know that Steam and Ubisoft? I I believe it because um Ubisoft always had its own agenda, especially when it came out to get with certain particular games. So um, I 100% I believe that. Then that is the first thing you should go looking for. When you found some, return to me, and I set you on your way. So she wants me to give her the gold. She wants you to do the hard work for her. I got you. Okay. Let me get my other rifle out. I, I gotta hit the gun store. I'm not. I, I don't even have a lot of ammo. These people keep jumping on me. Oh man. I mean, it should it should get removed because if you're a new player. And you're good at the game in Apex, and you're good in the beginning of the game. You shouldn't get, you shouldn't be playing with Apex Diamonds or Apex Predators because they're good when you first start out, and that's pretty messed up. I right, feel it, bro. See you later. Oh, really? I didn't know that Ubisoft was a friend of Discord. I thought they were. I had no idea. I right, Felix, bro. See you, bud. It's such a huge map. Like, you, look how much stuff you could add here, honestly. Like, I could live over here. If, if they had their own housing in Red Dead, you could put houses all around the map and you could put them for certain prices. Then, us as players, we would have to grind and do missions to buy a house. Like, it's, it's what makes the game go round and round. Just like GTA, we all worked hard to get that, um, that mansion apartment. So we grind and we did those little missions with Gerald and, and other people just to get that apartment. This game should have had the same thing. The camp was such a cop out. Chief! What's up, bro? Yeah, the map is so big, man. This... Chief! Welcome, bro. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Look how big this map is. Like, you could put so many houses on this map. So many. It goes all the way. Look, look at this. This is ridiculous. And I'm, where am I right now? I'm right here. They're creating a new game. Oh uh, man, they need to because they're not making, I don't think, I think this game is just lacking a lot of stuff that you should be able to do. It's lacking a lot. And everybody knows Rockstar games are really easy to play too. They need to throw a game that's as realistic as um, GTA. I mean, I, towards the end of GTA, it kind of got fake with the flying cars and the, the wing, the wing motorcycles and the, with the rockets. You might buy this game, Chief. You should, man. It's a good game. SoCom Panics, welcome, bro. Welcome to the stream. Thank you for dropping that like. Appreciate it, man. It, this is a good game, and I'm not going to lie 100%, Chief, that the, the story mode, it's amazing. It's an amazing ride, and it'll take you days to finish. However, when you finish the story mode, the online gets really stale. It gets really, really... Like, as you can see, I'm playing online right now, and I, I didn't really dive in too much of this game, and there's not much for me to do here. I mean, I could go fishing, I could go, um, what else, I could, I could probably buy a new horse, I could buy a new gun, I could buy some clothes, 
But then other than that, I mean, it'll get stale because there's nothing to really do other than drive around and terrorize other players. I mean, the story mode is really where this game thrives at. Story mode is amazing. Thank you for agreeing with me, SoCom, for real. Because, I mean, that that's what I think this game is about. With search engine optimization. Uh, what do you mean by that, man? <laughs> I wish I don't know what you mean. Hey, what do you mean by that, Chief? Oh, you're talking. Are you talking about the people who created uh, Resident Evil? Because if you're talking about those people, they're doing an amazing job. Just like Respawn Entertainment right now. Respawn is fucking killing it right now with their Star Wars and the fucking Apex. They're doing a, they're killing it right now. Plenty of road to spare. Suggest you use yeah, I agree, SoCom, for real, hundred percent. But they, but search um engines organization, they, I I think they're doing a good job. They did Resident Evil Two and Resident Evil Two was a great game. And that was search engines uh organization that who created that game as well and I enjoyed every single bit of Resident Evil 2 the remake so I mean oh I'm a huge fan of Resident Evil man I'm a huge fan I beat them all I beat them all and I, I just love them I love the game oh what's going on with this should we put it out of its misery is it hurting right now no, no, I don't want to kill it. How do I get? How do I get the arrow out? Hold on. Hold on, hold on. How do we get this arrow out of this thing? This doesn't look like there's nothing I could do, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get you out of your misery. I'm sorry. I couldn't do anything about it. it wouldn't let me pull it out. So, I just gotta mercy you. <laughs> Yeah, I love these games too. I really do. And um I can't wait to see what Search Engine does with Resident Evil 3. Oh my god, with Nemesis running around all through town and you're playing as Jill, I cannot wait to see what Search Engine has in store, you know? Because I know that they're working on Resident Evil 3 right now. And that's going to be a hard remake to create because you got to make the characters really fast if you're going to run from Nemesis. But um, that's going to be way worse than Mr. X. Because Nemesis, he follows you throughout the whole game, you know? Mr. X just follows you like in certain pieces of the game. But Nemesis, he's already there from the beginning, you know? Breaking walls, destroying the police station. At least that's what I remember from uh, PlayStation 1. Damn, I gotta get some new clothes. I'm all bloodied up. Oh man, I wasn't really gonna pick up this wolf. I was gonna do that game mode, but I think I should sell the wolf now. Yeah, so come. They're remaking... Uh, Resident Evil 3, man, and I am so hype. I'm so hype about that. And I think it's coming out in next year, I believe, they said it was. So I, I really cannot wait for that. I really cannot wait. It's going to be such a great game. And a scary game at that. I just wonder how they're going to create it with... um. The over the shoulder um view. Yeah, they need to. You know what it was? Is cause they saw that Resident Evil two was a was a hit. So so they said, Oh, you know what, we gotta come out with three which I'm so happy they didn't say, you know what, two is so good. Let's remake part one again because honestly I don't really care to play part one. I played the remake, I played the second remake, I played the third remake. Like, we got three remakes of the same game. Yeah. 
I would, I'm much rather see um, Resident Evil 3. That game bright? It's a lot of rage. This is what game? You said it's called Bright? Wait, hold on. Where, where am I on the. You know what? Let's just go to the. Let's just get some money doing this thing. Here we go. Elimination series. Let's just jump in. Oh, I really should have got some more ammo. Oh, uh, well, well. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, it will. It really will. Just imagine, man. Like, like I don't think... How many remakes could they do a Resident Evil 1? Because, I mean, they could do another one with Over the Shoulder, but I don't know. Oh, dude, Medal of, Medal of Honor used to be my used to be my game, man. Used to be my game because um, Medal of Honor had such a good story mode. It had such a good story mode and the multiplayer that you could play with your friends. It was so good, and it felt real too at the time. Now they're actually thinking about making a, a new Medal of Honor game. But I wonder how that game is going to stack, stack up compared to um, Call of Duty and Battlefield right now. Unless you're thinking about just scrapping Battlefield and just straight up putting Medal of Honor, you know, then that'd be something. But I enjoyed, I enjoyed Medal of Honor when it, when it was out a long time ago. What was it? Pacific Sun. There was another title. I think there was a World War II one. Yeah, Call of Duty, man. Call of Duty's going downhill. That's why I said that. Like, I was telling people that in my... I think it was a couple of streams ago. I don't remember, I don't remember which stream. But I was telling people that um, Call of Duty needs something. That Call of Duty is seriously missing something right now. And I don't know what it is. Maybe they need to throw in another Battle Royale. Because it honestly, it needs the Battle Royale mode. But it's really missing something. And man, I loved it. The Metal Gear Solid 1, bro. When you when you got to a certain point, it said you needed to change this. It says, I remember they call you on the codec. And they go, Snake, you got to change your disc to part 2 to play the rest of the game. And then it's cool, you have to put in the, the part two this just to finish the game. They actually tried to add that into um, Metal Gear Solid 4. If you ever played Guns of Patriots, they say, oh, wait, we don't have to change this. This is a PS4. It automatically uh, puts the next part into it. That part was great. Psycho Mantis by far was the most craziest boss on PlayStation 1 because you had to um, you had to change your memory card port from 1 to 2. So you had to change the memory card port from 1 to 2. So you had to like... Um, Whenever he was attacking you and he did too much damage, you had to switch the part again to two, then you got to switch it to one. And you just had to keep taking the memory card in and out of the, the console. Just, and the controller, yeah. And the controller ports too. He was the biggest troll of Metal Gear Solid history. Biggest troll. He was deaf. Oh wait, what's happening now? Dispatch my opponents with a hatchet. Cool. Let's do it. How do I melee? I don't even remember how to melee. That's how long I, it, it it's been since I played this game. Oh, am I leaving the playing area? Okay. Man, I used to love having the Switch computer. I, I, I don't know. Like, it's like they, they just don't have a... 
a idea of um they don't have a good idea with switching the um with with these games anymore. It's like these games are just coming out um more and more less original. And we we want the more originality out of it, you know. No, I actually didn't get a chance to play Manhunt, but my friends who played Manhunt said that it was such a great game. They said easily one of the best games. Easily. And they said you should go and jump people. They used to tell me all the time, yo, get Manhunt, get Manhunt. But I think Manhunt was on Xbox, I believe. And at the time I had, I think it was PS2, I believe. Was it PS2? I th I'm not sure. Did Manhunt come out for 360? Cause it, it could have, but I, I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah. So at the time I had PlayStation, they had Xbox, and I was like, oh man, I want to see Manhunt. I never got a chance to see um, Manhunt though, but I heard it was definitely one of the best games to come out. Definitely. PS2 had it? For real? Damn, then I just missed out. I missed out heavy then. I missed out real heavy because I didn't know that they had a, um, they had that. Man, when I was playing PS2, I was playing, um, Metal Gear Solid 2 a lot. Is this Battle Royale with hatchets? Because I'm starting to feel like it's a Battle Royale mode with a hatchet. Like, I honestly don't know what's going on right now. It was gruesome, man. I'm sure it was, bro. Easily one of the best games. Easily. I was about to kill that deer, then I said, hold up. I'm not supposed to be killing, uh... Killing animals in this game mode. What am I doing? <laughs> Bro, I'm be honest, man. I'm not that good in PC. I'm really not like I have it for PC but I'm in diamond ranked in PS4 and when I get on um when I get on PC it's like I'm nothing in PC that's how good they are like just the other day I got five kills but it, it felt like I was playing a diamond game on PS4 and that was on PC you know and I don't know maybe it's because I'm using mouse maybe I'm using um Xbox controller right now because uh because I don't where is everybody like I'm hunting through I'm going like circle through circle hunting for people oh I did get seven oh my bad I got seven kills and I felt because usually when I first start the game I remember when I first started the game on um on PS4, I racked up 18 kills, and uh, and that's just the beginning of Apex. Now, especially on PC, I put up, like he said, seven kills, and I'm I'm not that good in uh on PC. It's way it's a little bit different. Man, so calm. Now that was my game before Call of Duty. Think I didn't see you? You think I didn't see you walking up on me? <laughs> what were you thinking? But yeah. Um, so calm two Navy Seals man was my favorite game. Truly my favorite game to play. Oh no! Someone asked me. Oh man. Oh really? Nice man. 
I loved it playing uh, SOCOM. It was just so tactical too. Like nothing beats SOCOM, especially in the tacticalness. I don't know why they never remade it or or just put it put it out now. And yeah, you could con you could connect the controller to PC, but again, you're playing against people who use mouse and keyboard. And to be honest, if you use mouse and keyboard in Apex, you can't possibly you can't really miss that hard because the mouse is super sensitive. And there's so much control on the mouse. So like you're you're gonna be a much better player playing on PC with mouse and keyboard like everybody else. <laughs> that face. <laughs> oh, they went broke? I don't know how though. Like everybody was buying that game. I I'm, I really don't understand how they got broke because they came out with SOCOM one, two, and three. And then ever since then, they somehow got broke out of nowhere. Man, that was so much of a flop, bro, that I didn't even know that they had a, a SOCOM for PlayStation 3. That's how much of a flop it was, and it sucks. No, right now for me it's 3.05 p.m. right now. Right? That was the first game you could do that. Now, now look, now Fortnite went out of control and started, now you could dance on people um, the moment you kill them. Fortnite took that trolling dance to a new level with that emote. I I don't get this. I, I thought we were gonna be shooting and out of nowhere we're um throwing tomahawks at each other. Let me go back to free room. Yeah, it's true. It's really true. Fortnite did pave the way though. And now it's like every game now you have to th you if they have a battle pass. Every single game has a battle pass now. Like out of nowhere. You know what you know what really guys, you know what I'm gonna get? Those of you who have modern warfare call of duty, right? What's the point for the season pass of that game? Because normally you would get a pass if it was like um, Apex or it was like Fortnite. But what's the point of the season pass if they don't have a battle royale? What I mean, what would be the need for it if you could just come out with a DLC pack and make people pay for that alone? But they said, oh, you know what? They're making a lot of money doing these passes, so let's just go ahead and throw a season one pass. Oh, that's great. Oh, man. Oh, what the hell is this? Again, just to get free cosmetics and stuff. They're definitely doing it for the money. That's for sure. They're definitely doing it for the money. Because honestly, bro, it's like, it doesn't make any sense. Like, I saw that season one pass. And I was like, I'm not getting that. I mean, yeah, it's a, I think the pass is a good thing too. Especially when you have, um... A game that has battle royale but you see you can make more money off the pass than you could with regular DLCs because people people want to pay the ten dollars for all that stuff instead of paying for one DLC at a time but the good thing about the one DLC at a time 
is that let's just say for instance right let's just say for instance you wanted to buy you wanted to buy something so you so you you look at the DLCs that they have and you go okay I could buy this one DLC for $15 I don't need to buy the other DLCs at all the battle pass has a whole bunch of useless crap in it like you'll get maybe one legendary skin or you'll get like one one cool looking um, gun skin and then after that it's just a whole bunch of useless stuff that you don't need whereas how it used to be was you either you buy this pack and if you don't want to play in this pack you just get that you know how do I see when is this black um, I'm Batman bro <laughs> I see everything <laughs> because I'm a beast that's why they made a game on the new engine they really be yeah <laughs> they they made yeah i think i think that's another reason why they have the battle pass as well because they made it on that new engine <laughs> because they made it on that new engine they you know i feel like they had to do the battle pass thing but to be honest like honestly you, you really don't need the battle pass for a game like like Call of Duty Modern Warfare that doesn't have battle royale because because honestly right now what what could you really get with the battle pass because I didn't really check it out too heavy but as far as I know as far as I know you could unlock a girl I think she's the only skin you get but I'm not too sure. Oh, I don't know because I'm Batman. I, I don't know. I, don't, I like Batman a lot. I would also go on the Flash too. I could be the Flash, you know. But I don't know. I like Superman, but I always, admi I always admired how the Flash and Batman handled things. I always thought that was cool. Dominica, hello. Welcome to the stream. And okay, so calm. I didn't know that um, there's other stuff. Like, like I said, I didn't really look at the battle pass or what I had to offer. So like I just didn't understand the point of a um a battle pass for a game that doesn't have battle royale. Just honestly it makes sense to me. No, I'm Batman. How dare you? All right, how about this? You could be Batman, I'm the Flash. I'm going I'm going to stick with the Flash. Okay? I I'm going to stick with the Flash, but I'll give up Batman for the Flash. I'll do it. Look at this guy. Oh, get out of here. We had to push him immediately. But, Dominica, you know why I say I'm Batman too? Because I actually have a Batman tattoo. Right on my arm. I have the Batman tattoo. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's why I say I'm Batman. But, I'll give it. I'll let you have it. I'll give it to you. And I got this, where is that, where's that tiger that I, I killed? That just jumped on me in the beginning and left this claw mark on my clothes. Oh wait, it's it's right here, there we go. Yay! <laughs> okay, I'm Batman now, thank you, appreciate it. You giving it up just for me. I feel the love, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. No, you want to be the Teletubby Dipsy? All right, you can be Dipsy. Right ahead. You can be Dipsy. <laughs> By the way, guys, make sure you guys uh, smash that like button if you're new to the channel. Make sure you subscribe. Really appreciate that, guys. Thank you so much. Oh, we got another guy to kill. Look at this guy. 
Goodbye. Get out of here. Thank you. Where's the gun store? I need to find a gun store. Honestly, Felix, um, I'm going to be honest here. You guys are about to hear some realness right now. And uh, the thing between uh, any last words and me, um, he, he actually was saying you, Felix, was trolling too much on his channel and he didn't like that. And, um, and he was blaming me because you were trolling on his channel. And I was telling him that, um, no, he's a cool guy. He's actually supporting. And um, he didn't like that. So that's why um, me and him just start working together. He said you write too much in his chat and he was really going off just about you alone. So um, honestly, I, 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 don't, I don't work with him um, too hard anymore. I, I'm kind of leaving him alone for that for now. Because I, I support, yeah, I support... Um, the people who come and support me and um I don't dog the people that you know that support so yeah there's drama but there's always drama Dominica there's always drama in the, in this industry you know this is what you got to deal with but um I don't mind you guys writing in my chat I love talking to you guys I love I love everything about this. This is really cool, chill conversation. And honestly, it's this whole experience for me personally, because I can't speak for him, but this whole experience for me has been amazing. And I've done nothing but enjoy this. You know, I enjoy my supporters. I, I enjoy everything. So, so I, I enjoy the GOAT family coming through, supporting me, showing me that love. Like, it, it's great. I know, SOCOM, I know, that what that is how it's supposed to be, but you know, some people, they, they just don't know, you know? Well, what it was, was that Felix had said something personal to the chat, and he had said that his dog died, and apparently that triggered him. And, and made him feel some type of way and he didn't want to talk to Felix ever again after that so um, that's weird I like to comfort people when stuff like that happens not push them away but you know to each his own why would you hate someone yeah I don't understand that either I love when people type I enjoy I'm enjoying you guys right now I don't understand it I really don't it is sad. It really, it really is, and um, I, I don't know why some people are just mean. You know, some people just don't know how to how to talk to people. You know, some people are just rude. I guess you. Oh wait, did I just kill something? I just had some road kill. Yeah. Yeah, you do. You do have to be a people person to YouTube. I mean, that that's one of the main requirements is that you should be a people person because if you're not, it's going to be extremely hard for you to um, put out anything because you're not. And then that's going to actually end up hurting you, you know. So you definitely want to be a people person for sure, 100%. And I wouldn't mind if someone came in my stream and said they were having a bad day. I would love to cheer them up. 
you know, I would love to talk to them about their problems. Let's have a good time. Let's have a nice, chill conversation. Because, honestly, that's what it's all about, you know? Do I want to try and play God of War? Bro, I love God of War. I actually beat the last one um, a while back ago, and it was great. It was such a good game. Amazing graphics. Something happened to me on Saturday, but I don't want to talk about it. Excuse no, Mr. Goat. You see, this is what it's for. You know, not only we could enjoy the game, but we could communicate with each other on such a, a personal, loving level, you know? But it's also fine that if it's too personal and you don't want to talk about it, you don't have to. But if you do, just know that we're here for you and we can talk with you through these problems, you know? There's a lot of people going through stuff and, um, you know, if you need someone to talk about it and you see me online, just come through, let's talk about it. Let's enjoy the game, let's talk about it, you know? I'm not going to shut you down. If you want to talk off stream too, I have my chat. I mean, I have my online name, so add me and we can talk in a party, or whatever, you know? Game of Goat Hunter, guys. Um, is it kind of hard? Yeah, it is. It is kind of hard to read and play at the same time, but to be honest, I enjoy having this chat and everything, man. I really do. Yeah, me too. I answer them no matter what, Dominica. Me too. I'm the same way. Yeah, even if it's even if it's a troll, because you know what, troll. Some people they like to come and troll, but you know what? If you talk to them enough, they'll stop trolling and they'll actually become a big supporter. You know, so like if you see a troll coming in your channel, drop them a dislike. When they come back, just talk to them. You know, they end up actually becoming your biggest supporters too, and you, you gotta just show love. You know. Yeah, it's a chat. Exactly, it's a chat. Like whether it's hate or not, we all go we all go through stuff, you know? We all we all need to talk it out. Do I know RuneScape? Jeez. RuneScape is a game that I played when I think when I was a kid. Man. And that was years ago. Oh man. I used to try to sneak on that website in school and try to play RuneScape in school. Play you can you play Fortnite? Oh, of course, man. Could definitely play Fortnite uh, when the Christmas update comes out for sure. I actually might get a Santa Claus, man, if they have it. <laughs> Classic. Let's be honest, yeah, man. <laughs> now is mobile. They have the mobile version. Oh, okay. Yeah, there are a lot of people really sensitive on YouTube. And, uh, I don't know, with them, you kind of got to tap dance a little bit. You got to, a lot of people are not built strong. So you just have to be careful with, like, the words that you say to them. Because it could, they could be triggered, like, just like that, you know? Like, honestly, like, because there's some guys that, I'm, you know, let's be honest. We, 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 we're keeping it real in this chat. So let's just keep it real. There's some guys out there acting like little girls. You know, really, and, and it's crazy. Like, they get triggered off of the most littlest thing. It could be something little, as little as um, me saying, oh, I fell in the garbage. Oh, I, and then they remember they fell in the garbage back in the day, and then they get triggered off of that. So it's like, you got to be careful with the, the, the things that you say. 
Was I good at school? Yeah, I was pretty good at school, man. I'm gonna be honest. I, I, I did it. I did, and I don't advocate this, by the way. The kids that's watching right now, I don't want you guys to do this. But he's asking me a question, and I have to be honest with you guys. I did cut a lot. I did. I cut a lot of school to play some Call of Duty, to play some, um, to play some basketball. I've done it, and I'm sorry, guys. But I was a good student, and I, I did get, I did get good grades. I was a B student, okay? I was B, B plus, sometimes A when I, when I tried hard, you know. I graduated high school and I did two years of college on uh, criminal justice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, maybe. Thank you. Okay. I got many bad. Yeah, yeah. You it can't touch you because honestly, I mean, like you can't control what people do. You could only control what you say or what you do. So I wouldn't even worry about it. Honestly, don't don't worry about it, Dominica. If it happens, it happens. You know. Yeah, you give me your Steam link. Yeah. I actually, guys, I, I just got into PC gaming. So if I suck, I'm because I'm gonna put up uploads and videos about that. If I'm terrible at it, you know, it's because I'm switching to a new thing altogether. And there's not many games that you could put on the controller, so um, you know, don't judge me too hard. <laughs> What gets me is most of these games are level 17 and older. When to five could get offended while playing the game. Yo, that's a that's a really interesting topic that you put out there, uh, so calm. And before I get to you, Mantis, let me let me get to this topic real quick. I don't know if you see I don't know what's um around your guys' area, but I'm gonna ex describe my experience with that. You ever walk into a GameStop and you see a little kid and you see their parent and uh, you see the, the lady buying Call of Duty. Let's start the game, a game like Modern Warfare because the story mode in that was definitely not for kids. So we're going to use Modern Warfare as the example. So a lady walks in a GameStop and buys Modern Warfare. Now, the guy at GameStop doesn't tell the lady... You're not buying that for yourself. You're buying that for a five-year-old kid. No, they're not going to tell you that because they want the lady to purchase it. Even though they know it's not for them, they know they're buying it for their five-year-old kid. So usually that five-year-old kid that um, starts playing the game, he gets on and he starts getting offended or scared or whatever from the content that he's seeing from the game because it's a game that he should never play to begin with. And there's a lot of kids out there who got games like that who shouldn't honestly have that game. But, you know, at the same time, I mean, everybody at school is talking about it. Their parents are buying it. So it's like, you know, you got to expect kids on every single game, even the, even the horrific ones, you know. Because, to be honest, there, there's no limits for what they could buy. Hey, brethren, thank you for dropping that like, man. Yeah, people only care about money these days. It's true. It is true. Okay, man, this is not a bad thing. Okay. 
Yeah, and pe people just keep buying a lot of kid, a lot of underage kids these games that they're not supposed to have. But at the same time, you kind of you gotta expect that they're gonna get the game too because of their parents. So there's really nothing you can do about it. Best thing you, I, I, best advice I could give is just if someone seems offended by a certain game. Um, well, are you talking about when you're streaming, or you're talking about like in general, like kids get offended by the game so calm? Because uh, it is a little bit different there. Yeah, me too, SoCom. 100% agree, bro. 100%. You were playing Blackout with a six-year-old the other day? Oh, man. Oh, man. You know the funny thing? I played Apex with a, with a little kid one day, and he said that my parents told me not to pick up any light weapons or heavy weapons. I could only use energy weapons because energy weapons are not real. So that was the only kind of weapons he was allowed to grab throughout the whole game. But that little kid was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. He was killing it. He was doing better than me, actually, with those energy weapons. Oh, both? Well, what I can say to you, SoCom, is that when, when you're streaming and you, and you feel like there's a kid being offended by it, if you don't want kids in your channel, you you should um, definitely go on a party, for sure. Ma make a private party, and um, I don't know, I'd go from there. Or you could just put 18 plus on your title. That way, you know. Yeah, just put 18 plus in your title, man. And if they come, you can't stop that. And if they get offended, that's on them for joining the stream because you have 18 plus as your content. But if you don't care and you want kids in your stream, just minimize the, the curse words and minimize, um, you know, you, the way you talk. You know, if you, it, like, if you speak with a family, make sure that you just minimize it as much as you can, you know. Mr. Go, that's why I created Fortnite. <laughs> yeah. There are many parents who are not ready to have kids, but they buy them stuff. Yeah, it's true, Dominica. It's true. It happens a lot. Well, that's the thing, so calm, is that the, the rules in Twitch, it wasn't as complicated, but to be honest, it was all, also oversaturated at the same time because twitch is actually people say that twitching on like streaming on twitch is easier i disagree with that personally and i'm and i'm gonna say this i'm gonna say wh um why i disagree that twitch is easier because in every phone that you buy every single phone whether it be old or new the youtube app is always on the phone it's always there on the main screen. People, a lot of people don't know about Twitch. And the people who do hear about it and then they have to download the app. YouTube is already there on the phone. So everybody's already on YouTube way before they even hit Twitch. You know? I don't know about that, Goat. <laughs> well, maybe. It could be. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what influences the kids to do some crazy stuff like that. Uh no, man, it's just not yet. I gotta, I gotta sell this pelt. I gotta sell this pelt, and I, uh, I gotta, I gotta catch a fish. Oh man, I need a. I need to sell this stuff. I think Saint Denis has a. Damn, but look how far that is. Is there another place? Oh, Valentine. I go to Valentine. You sell my pelt over there. Mm. 
<laughs> but yeah, I just hope that um, the games, like, there's, there's a lot of games coming out, and I think everybody's seen these games that kids shouldn't have. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not down. First of all, I just want to say it too. I'm also not shutting down the the kids too. You, these, if you, if your parents allow it and everything. I mean, there, there's there's some option in Call of Duty where you could put like you could turn the blood off and you could skip the missions where you know where all the gore and stuff happens, where all the dark stuff happens. You know, to be on to be honest, is on the kid to be responsible enough to press that, which I don't think a lot of them do because I think they just want to play the game for what it is, but. They could just put on that parental on control as well. Hey, bro, welcome to the stream. He screams, Yay! Yay! <laughs> welcome, man. <laughs> welcome to the stream. Make sure you guys smash that like button if you're new to the channel. Make sure you subscribe. Really appreciate it. But yeah, I, I'm, I'm, by the way, guys, I just want you to know, I'm loving this real chat that we got going on. Like, we're talking about real problems in and outside of, of the YouTube community and outside, um, outside, you know, real life problems. I think that's just dope that we could just sit here and talk about it because, um, it's like, it's a lot of stuff going on. Yeah, the game, visually, the game is amazing, bro. Visually, this, these graphics are really bomb. It's just like I was saying earlier, if you wasn't here, um, the game is just lacking so much stuff. It's like it's an open world game and you just do what you want. There's nothing really to do here. No real missions. Mr. Goat, uh, a lot of kids watch YouTube on their mom's phone. It doesn't, it doesn't matter if it's age restricted. Um, true, that's true too. However, that's on the responsibility of the mom because if uh, she shouldn't give her child access to the phone or or any any other um channels like that if they're not supposed to have it. So really, the response, the burden of responsibility is on the parent, you know. Well, yeah, all kids these days have smartphones for sure. Back in my day, they didn't have smartphones. I'm, I'm talking about smartphones wasn't even a thing. I don't know if any of you guys are my age or around my age, but you guys remember when that Razer came out? You remember when when the, when the sidekick was a thing where everybody was so hyped and they were flipping that sidekick left and right? Because I didn't have one. <laughs> but that's that's what's a, that that is what was a thing around my time. We had the razor, we had the sidekick. How old am I? <laughs> yeah, uh, kids alter the account mantis for sure. You guys really know want to know uh, how old am I? I'm in my 20s, guys. Just know that I'm in my 20s. <laughs> I, I like how you, you flip the script like that, but I, I, I thought that myself, Domenico, that, um, you, you're 20s, you, you, okay. Oh, you're 28, okay. You're older than me, bro. <laughs> You're older than me, man. <laughs> Kids, uh, yeah, I believe I I miss it when um twenty three forty four. Oh my gosh. Okay, good. That's cool, man. Forty four, bro. It's awesome, bro. Twenty three, Dominica. Nice. You're younger than me. <laughs> you are younger than me, Dominica. I'm a huge fan of Dragon Ball Z. And the fact that they... I remember that, too. When they got rid of the blood. Back in my day, 
<laughs> and I know I sound old when I say that, and you're probably like, listen, dude, I'm 44. I don't know what you're talking about. But back in my day, <laughs> uh, they used to have blood in Dragon Ball Z. There was, um, I remember um, Goku would get hurt and there'd be blood just leaking. Especially back in the day, Piccolo didn't have, what was it, what, did, what kind of blood does he have now? Like purple blood or, or blue blood? Back in the day, he was the leaking real blood out of his arm and Raditz shot his arm off. So, like, they changed a lot of stuff. <laughs> I sound 26, Mr. Goat. Oh, man. You... Ah! 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 You're right. I am 26. You're right. Ah, you're so close. You're so right. You're 17 years old, man. Just nice, man. Yeah, there was a lot of blood in that. In that. You don't remember yesterday? <laughs> Me either, bro. I'm 26. <laughs> Me either. <laughs> Actually, just turned 26 in October. Um, I'm, so yeah. Well, the comments a great game, bro. <laughs> I didn't think you caught that voice crack. Oh no! <laughs> you caught my you caught my voice cracking up. Oh no! <laughs> Anthony, hello, welcome. Damn, you still have your Sega. Oh man. You still got that Sega, okay. Wait, Sega Dreamcast? Or we're talking about like Sega We're talking that old. How old are we talking now? Cause I know you're not talking about Sega. You're probably talking about Dreamcast, aren't you? She never understood Red Dead. Oh. <laughs> no, no special beam. No. <laughs> you probably charged up for that one too. The Moonshine DLC. Bro, you actually talking about that old Sega Genesis? Damn. No way! Watch this guy shoot me for no reason. I feel like he's gonna shoot me. I don't know why. Oh wait, let's, let's get back on the horse. And it still works, bro. Sell that on eBay. <laughs> you gonna make? You gonna get? A, you might get a lot of money for people who uh who collect old consoles. Sell it, bro. Or sell it in 2022. Get a lot of money for that. <laughs> it's history. <laughs> it is, man. Oh, man. Sega. Watch this guy kill me. I really feel like he's going to kill me while I'm trying to sell my meat. Oh, he's not. You charge it for two minutes, I'm already dead. How, how could you charge that special beam cannon? Why would you do that? <laughs> Two minutes straight? You had time. You sell it when the Sega comp company crumbles? Yeah. I, th I think it's almost already, uh... It's almost already crumbled already. <laughs> not open, too. Congrats, I'm not even opening it, bro. Now you're doing... There you go, Mantis, he deflected your final flash with his Kamehameha, that's what he did. So, so now I'm safe because he, he put in some energy in that. Oh, and he chopped off your legs with Destructo this, so you're, you're done. <laughs> he chopped off your legs too. <laughs> it looks like I'm 
This, look, look how healthy this this guy is, is uh, f fixing up this meat. No gloves on. He got his beard hair all over the meat. This is great. There's, it seems I buy this near every day. He buys it every every day. He said. Pretty standard fare these days. He doesn't even wash his hands. Seems I buy this near every day. Big bang. Oh. Uh, how did you do that with chopped off legs? <laughs> now he's throwing supernovas. You destroyed the whole world with that. You destroyed it. You destroyed it, Mantis. That one blast, you did it. Oh, why did this not sell? Oh, somebody's shooting again. Oh, my, my horse ran, didn't it? Dude. Can I sell my meat, guy? Can I sell my meat without you coming through? Appreciate it. Jeez. Gotta wait your turn. Really gotta wait your turn, man. There we go. Wait, he's selling some deer. He's selling some deer. You go ahead, sell your deer. Uh, people are going past the mode like you're ready to kill them. Oh wait, no, 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 please, look at this guy, come on, let me just park my horse. Your beams are the best, no it's not. <laughs> also, acquired a working Nintendo 64 and still had the Game Boy Color, jeez dude, you got quite a collection on your hands, I'll tell you that. You sell that one day, you're going to be rich from those stuff alone. Oh, of course. I knew it. I knew that was going to happen. I knew it. I'm, you know what? I'm going to press charges on them. I'm going to press charges. <laughs> okay, Anthony. See you later. Okay. Yeah, GT GT was in canon. You can't use those attacks. GT was like a, a extra add-on because they didn't know what else to put out after Dragon Ball Z. GT was not canon. You can't use those cat attacks. If you do super attacks, I think super was canon though. Look at this guy. Just chill out, dude. I'm just trying to kill play some poker and people are just clapping me left and right just relax guy I just want to get in I want to get a beer I want to relax there we go let's get in here and play some poker there we go and they still won't let me play poker oh it's not available in party chat that's interesting <laughs> Bro, you remember that fuck you remember that um <clears throat> it was a commercial with Boost Mobile and uh all the rappers were in it. And they were advertising that Boost Mobile phone with the chirp. What was it? Kanye was in there, a couple other I think Jada Kiss was in there. A couple other people were in there, the the whole city behind the song. That's what I remember about the chirp phones being broadcast. We're all gonna pay now. Ah, <laughs> uh, we can't beat that spirit bomb. We can't beat it. It's too strong. No, you know what? That spirit bomb is weak because I didn't raise my hands to give you any energy. So that's a weak spirit bomb. <laughs> Transformers behind you. That's great. Wait, hold on. Let me give it a party chat. Alright, let's see if they'll let me do it now. 
Alright, there we go. He did delete him though. He didn't even kill him. He deleted him. Yeah, there's a yep, that's the strongest move right there. There's nothing that could top that move. Alright. No, nothing can top it. I think that's the strongest move there. Oh, DBZ. DBZ would definitely beat Mar Marvel. You have to realize how strong, like how overpowered this anime is. Like, DBZ is so much stronger than anything else out there. Nobody's stronger than any of them in Jack Mosey. Marvel would just get destroyed. Even the strongest person in Marvel would get destroyed by like Super Saiyan Goku would destroy him. And that's only Super Saiyan for him. I'm talking about destroying the strongest person in Marvel Comics. Like Yeah, easily D DBZ. Now if you said for instance you said DC and Marvel now we got a conversation here but I would argue D, uh, DC is stronger than Marvel only because of Superman nobody and I mean nobody in Marvel could take on Superman not even the Hulk not even the Hulk yeah Krillin would destroy Marvel easily <laughs> and he's the weakest character I know Yancha would destroy Marvel and he's the weakest one of all you know yeah Kryptonite would destroy Superman however nobody in Marvel has access to Kryptonite and the only way they would get it is if they knew if they beat somebody lesser in um If they oh why did I fold? Oh man, that was that was foolish. Maybe Captain Marvel could no. Captain Marvel would get destroyed by Superman. The thing about Superman is that Superman is already strong, not being near the sun. If for some reason somebody's dumb enough to fight Superman in space all Superman has to do is go into the sun and if he goes into the sun no one becomes stronger than him yeah so nobody could destroy Superman nobody not, I mean, they would need kryptonite, and honestly, I don't know how they're getting their hands on it in Marvel. I really don't know. Maybe Spider-Man would get his hands on the kryptonite and then try to fight, but then you have to realize that Superman has some pretty intense backups. Like Shazam, you got a lot of people. That's an, inter that's an interesting fight, and... I would say Goku would win that fight against Superman only because like he never stops getting stronger and with Superman unfortunately there is a limit now if Superman went into the Sun it would be kind of different but at the same time I I don't know Yeah, I guess if Goku went Super Saiyan Blue, I, I really, I don't think there'd be anything Superman could do about it. Now, 
No, I think Goku at this point now, Goku is way stronger than Beerus. For sure. Yeah, he could. Easy. Man, you guys are making me want to play Dragon Ball Z, I'm telling you. You guys make me want to play Dragon Ball Z Fighters. Again. <laughs> yeah, he, he probably would. Alright guys, I love you guys and at 4, I'm going to be shutting down the stream only because my food just came through the door, my Chinese food guys, and I'm starving. But I will de I might pick up the stream later or if I don't do it later, it will definitely be tomorrow. And I think tomorrow because of all this Dragon Ball Z talk, I'm going to be streaming Dragon Ball Z Fighters for sure. So... Um, And yeah, he was stronger as a kid. Yeah. So and this food is smelling amazing. I'm telling you, it's Chinese food. And Dominic, I got you. Tomorrow, I will definitely play Dragon Ball Z Fighters. Yes. Do you have it? If you have it, we could play. I'll play against you. Although, I'm really rusty, guys. I haven't played it in a while. I'm pretty rusty. Yes, yeah, stream it. Okay. Um. Um. You know what? I might do it. Mm. I'm definitely do that stream tomorrow, guys. The Jack Mozi Fighters. I don't know if you guys have Discord, but you guys should add me on Discord. I would love to talk to you guys. Um, off stream as well. My online Discord name is Gamer Goat Hunter, and the numbers are three nine zero zero. That's my Discord. So if you guys have Discord, add me. I would love to get in contact with all of you guys. Have this chill conversation. Yeah, we could play some Apex tomorrow for sure, dude. Hell yeah. You guys are amazing. Thank you guys for joining me here today. Really appreciate it. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate the support. I love you guys. I love my GOAT family. And just thank you for joining us. Really. Thank you for joining me today. And um, make sure you guys drop that like if you're new to the channel. Make sure you subscribe and ring that bell to be notified because they know exactly when I go online again. And that way we can all join up together and play some Dragon Ball Z Fighters because that would be great. I can't wait to do that now. Thank you, man. Thank you. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Man, it was fun. Thank you so much. It was really fun. You guys are amazing. Thank you. <laughs> she said, hey, sugar, how you doing, Miss Lady? How you doing? All right. <laughs> All right, guys, All right, you guys have a good day, and I'm going to end my stream now, but thank you so much for joining. Make sure you smash that like button and make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much. Nice chatting with you, too, man. Hopefully, I see you in my next stream, man. Really appreciate you coming through so calm. We had some really calm conversation. <laughs> he said good luck sugar <laughs> you too bro it's <laughs> great you guys are great